the unstoppable denominator. Hey. Election thing went off without a hitch. Now I'll have the best tax write offs I could ever get. Well, he has nothing but getting blamed for the U.S. going to H E double hockey sticks. Oh, life's a bitch. Wait, except it ain't for me, cause I'm still rich. Take it away, boys. Oh, I never really wanted that low-wage president job to ain't my career. Besides, who on earth could possibly get by on $400,000 a year? Now that I'm done pretending to have fun spending time with the plebeians, my speaking fee will multiply by three, so if you ask me, we won. This may be the happiest day of my entire life. Toothy bump fuck! Rich. Filthy rich. Trust me, my strategy worked perfectly, didn't have one single glitch. Shucks, I can go overseas and invest in whatever I darn well please. While Obama triple double checks his pension to make sure it isn't overly Chinese. It's over 9,000! Life's a flippin' bitch! This is delicious! Hello, welcome to the Unstoppable Denominator Show. Today, let's talk about NHL hockey. The NHL hockey brought back. It's back. Now, the reason why they're back is to for you fans out there, like me. I like the Boston Bruins. But the thing is, I wanted to have them come back next season. Not this. It's too late. It's already almost April. For Christ's sakes. It's almost April. We got, let's see. It's almost February. So one, March. Three months away from April and they don't have time to make up all these games no why bring back NHL should have brought it back when you're supposed to bring it back like in the beginning of the season you had all this time to plan out the you had all this time to plan out I'm bringing back NHL. Bull crap. Why? Why do I have to ask? Why are you bringing NHL back? And it's already too late. Bring it back in next October. For crying out loud. Should have brought it back last last year in 2012, not 2013. It's too late. I know I love hockey, but thing is, it's too late. Later's. <laughs> 